so a quick update because I know I haven't posted in almost two weeks. Um, it's the holidays and we have eight children, so super busy. Um, and Christmas is right around the corner and um, trying to get that all together. Um, we had a visitor with us. Um, he was here for about a week and um, Thanksgiving. Oh, and I made my first vegan Thanksgiving. Well, half vegan because um, I did go vegan um, for about three months now and I am now raw vegan and I am the only one in this house that is vegan. <laughs> uh, my kids and my husband are not, which is totally fine. Um, I'm not like a picky old oh, vegan vegan, <laughs> but yeah. And uh, they actually allowed me to make a somewhat vegan uh, Thanksgiving. And the only thing that was not was the turkey. And it was fantastic. <laughs> so yeah, I even made my pies and it all worked out. And now Christmas is coming and we're getting everything together, getting everybody ready, because not only are we gonna be celebrating Christmas, we have three birthdays in December. So budget, but gotta budget all that. And uh, it is our two youngest and my husband that are celebrating in December. So we're gonna work that out. My husband wants to celebrate the girls' birthday separately. I do not because it's just not, um, budget smart, <laughs> but he's insisting that they celebrate them separately. So he is, that is all his doing. <laughs> um, if I had my choice, like I said, which I do, but I'm going to let him have his way be just because, just because. <laughs> so, and then, um, his birthday is also to December. So we did that, but I was really happy because we ended up doing our Christmas shopping early this year. So it is all done. Um, yeah, so very happy with that. I ain't got to worry about that. I ain't got to like do nothing. I have maybe two more gifts that I need to pick up. Yeah, I think two more because one just popped up um that uh we thought grandma was was going to be getting for one of our children but she let us know that she couldn't get it she got her something else and uh she, one, our daughter's really looking forward to this gift so we have to pick that up last minute um which we'll be doing that tomorrow because it needs to be picked up like now like i don't want to be rushing around with everybody at the end of the time oh my gosh so yeah and then um Oh, another exciting and big thing is, is we are going to be moving now. <laughs> We're going to be moving from Washington State to Indiana. And I have made a big move like this before uh, in the past to where I uh, moved from Washington to Mississippi and to Florida. Really didn't enjoy Florida. Um, just too crowded because we were in Miami uh, and it was just not my thing. I need, I need trees, I need grass, I need woods, I need just, I need that, <laughs> like I need that, and I need mountains. <laughs> now, um, so yeah, so we're gonna be making that big move again, and um, this time though we're gonna make it kind of permanent because um, we are going to be looking to buy a house. And um, I will figure that out. We will be buying a house. <laughs> so we're gonna be on a more of a budget, but income wise and budget wise, moving to Indiana is very smart for us. And also it's where my husband's family is at. So we'll be surrounded by a lot more family. Um, and I'll be meeting all of them for the first time. And I think within the next couple of months, I'll be meeting my in-laws for the first time. <laughs> And so <laughs> that's coming up. And so we're about to see how that happens. Um, so yeah, so you guys will also be joining us for that. I'm going to keep you, uh, try to get back onto weekly uh, videos as soon as Christmas is over. Um, and also keep you guys posted about the diet and stuff like that that's going on because since Bubba is our last baby and it just wreaked havoc on my body, um, I ended up having a C-section. Um, I almost died twice after having him. Um, I uh, 
got a clot in my lung after having him almost died, got put on blood thinners, had a delayed allergic reaction to the Lofenox shot, almost died again. <laughs> um, and my heart had some heart issues where I had, I hate admitting this, but I had a, a very small, mild heart attack, I want to say. Um, and, um, they had to give me like this stuff that I put underneath my tongue to get my heart to get back under control and stuff like that. Um, and I hate admitting that, but uh, that's just how it is. And so, um, and now I am dealing with, um, heart palpitations because of it. And I was having bad anxiety, anxiety attacks because of this, uh, because when I was told about the clot in my lung, they were just like, you have a uh, So glad that, sorry, my phone had shut off. Uh, so glad you didn't die. So take this, uh, make an appointment here, make it quick. Didn't explain to me what was happening and set me into panic attacks. Um, and then just a whole bunch of stuff just followed afterwards. And I kind of think that is because I'm used to having my babies naturally. So my body was like, oh, this is not how we have babies. Like, why is this baby being cut out of you? <laughs> so just kind of set my body into a haywire, developed palpitations, all that. So um, I'm on a raw vegan diet to get my body back down to size and become healthy again. Um, because this is the biggest that I have ever been. So you guys will also be doing that journey with me as well. And um, like I, back to like what I was saying, sorry, back to what I was saying is you guys will be joining me for the journey of packing and moving across, across the US with our children, <laughs> um, with eight babies. <laughs> and so I'm gonna be downsizing our home. I'm gonna be downsizing with a lot of stuff, giving a lot of stuff away, um, just things like that. And so I'm gonna start about april or june and i'm gonna start packing up the house slowly and um just getting rid of a lot of stuff that i don't want to need i want to make our move as light as possible and then the children will be going ahead of us and then we will be joining them uh joining them like a week later um with the stuff and we're actually not, I'm actually not sure how that's going to work. Actually, they are going to go a week early anyways with their dad. Um, if we're going to rent a truck and drive it down there or a pod or have somebody else drive it down there. Um, but we are going to be saving for that. So it just depends on how much we uh, have saved up for that. And then because we are going to be penny pinching even tighter so that we can get this done. And so, yeah. And uh, let's see what else. Hmm. So that is our update. That is my update. <laughs> and Bubba is growing so big and so fine. Oh, yeah. And um, I think that's everything. Yeah. So that's pretty much, pretty much. Sorry, I'm trying to think of anything else that I should update you guys with. Um, so, yeah. Oh, and I'll be doing another grocery haul um, next week. I'll be posting up another grocery haul for you guys, um, which actually worked out really great. And going over our grocery list and everything with you guys and telling you guys how much it was. And again, like I said, we are savers because we have eight children, but we also have four, uh, three grown boys and one toddler. But if we count my husband, that's four grown boys <laughs> that eat everything so <laughs> and out of house and home <laughs> so yeah so that is my video update and i will keep you guys updated with anything else um that comes up and i will try to get another video out soon like i said which should be uh the grocery video and then um kind of just take you guys on a journey with us through the packing and the moving through my diet yeah yeah that's everything it's everything 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 why did I just do that <laughs> okay so yeah so I will I'm gonna end this now okay so I will talk to you guys later